And there they go. And Costa Queen is showing good speed. Oh, Dilly wants to go early from the inside. Release the memo is also forwardly positioned from between gals. Ladriel's Light comes away in the fourth position and Analyze with Honor is the last of the quintet. Odilly is the quickest. She leads three parts of a length to release the memo and in Costa Queen pressing three wide. Ledriel's Light is in the clear from the fourth spot. She gets within two and a half. It's a break of six lengths to Analyze with Honor. 22 and one fifth from Odilly, the leader at the three eighths, a length to in Costa Queen. Galadriel's Light's into the third spot. Release the memo is backpedaling. She's all the way back to fourth, losing ground. Analyze with honor is at the tail. Odilly still with the lead and Costa Queen being pushed on, trying to stay in touch. Gledriel's light with a wide journey to the far outside, then release the memo and analyze with honor. They're in the lane and Odilly's the one to come and catch. Odilly with the lead from Galadriel's light in the third spot is in Costa Queen a long ways back to release the memo. Oh, Dilly trying to get to the wire, still with the lead. Oh, Dilly by more than a length and a half. Oh, Dilly clings to the lead. Galadriel's light with a late push to the outside. Galadriel's light a lot. Cents. The exact is $17.60. The dollar super, $32.75. And there they go. Bye Bye Love is showing pace. Cool as you like is forwardly positioned. Trey Charmon wants to go. So too does D-Sis 4Y. D-Sis and Trey Charmon a little quicker than the other two showing pace. Belle Coore is the last of five, but she's up close and she makes a move into fourth. D-Sis 3Y. Trey Charmon the middle gal. Cool as you like pressing from the rail. Belle Coore to the far outside is two and a half off the pace covering Bye Bye Love. It's a compact group of five fillies and mares. As they race to the far turn run. 22 and 1 fifth the opening quarter. Trey Charmon now has a neck advantage to DCS. Bell Coore makes her move to the outside. And bye bye, love has to bide her time from the fourth spot. Cool as you like, the first to back out of it. Bell Coore with a three or four wide run. Trey Charmon sticks around DCS, backpedals. Bye bye, love now takes over third. She's skimming the fence, turning for home. Bell Coore, Trey Charmon. Bye bye, love up the rail comes with her run. Bell Coare to the stand side. Bye bye, love from the rail. Trey Charmon still fighting gamely from between gals. Bye bye, love. Bell Coare, Trey Charmon. Bye bye, love. The early double to Baez and Buckley. Two five three trifecta thirty seven dollars thirty seven cents. The dollar super one hundred fourteen dollars fifty cents. 5-2, Buckley and Baez double, a good one, $107.50. Race three is clear of change, post time in 23 minutes at 2.06. And there they go. And out for the lead is Friendship 7 with discreet ransom. From the far outside, we have here comes Arnold. Buddy Meister makes a move for third along the inside. Shuffling Madness is in the fifth position and Velvet Cat is the last of six. Friendship 7 and Discreet Ransom take it to one another. Striding into third is Buddy Meister along the inside. Here comes Arnold. Now makes a move for that spot from the extreme outside. Shuffling Madness is in the fifth position. A little less than six off the leaders. And at the back of the pack there is Velvet Cat. So on the front end, Discreet Ransom from Friendship 7. Buddy Meister pursues from third inside of Here Comes Arnold. Shuffling Madness five lengths off the lead. Better than three and a half to Velvet Cat. Friendship 7 turns for home with the lead. Discreet Ransom stays close from his outside. Friendship 7 gets clear at the 8th pole. Now coming through along the inside is Shuffling Madness. Here comes Shuffling Madness and Velvet Cat is storming home to the far outside. Friendship 7 trying to get there. Will he break through this afternoon? Velvet Cat late on the scene. Friendship 7. He hangs on. He breaks through and... 4-3 exact is $16.60. dollars 60 4 3 one trifecta $8.60. The dollar super $39. A 2-4 daily double $76. 5-2-4 pick three $70.50. 
Fourth race, scratch number five, Detti Fox. And there they go. Bedside Blues began the best from the inside, and David Rocks is showing plenty of speed. And Jim Two is right behind them in third. Then there's a big break to the other six. Let's call it about seven lengths to George's Volley, Escape to the Moon, and Zoo Yorker. David Rocks and Bedside Blues side by side. They ensure a good pace, and look at the trip. Jim Two gets isolated in third. Two and a half off the battle, and about 10 lengths in front of his next rival. It was Escape to the Moon with George's Volley, and they have almost three lengths on Zoo Yorker. 21 and four fifths. Bedside Blues has had enough of David Rocks. He shakes away from him. Jim Two makes a move for second. Bedside Blues still looks pretty good near the quarter pole. He builds up a three-length advantage to Jim Two, who's been getting the run of the race. Now Escape to the Moon starting to close in up the inside. George's Folly chasing after him, then Zoo Yorker. Bedside Blues with the lead to David Rocks, soften him up enough. Up the inside comes Escape to the Moon, and Jim Two to the far outside, and George's Folly. Bedside Blues still with the lead. Up the inside is Escape to the Moon. Bedside Blues and Escape to the Moon. Bedside Blues above and beyond all. Escape to the Moon. Oh, one three exact at twelve dollars eighty cents. The trifecta fourteen dollars eighty seven cents. The dollar super one hundred sixteen dollars fifty cents. A four one double fourteen dollars. Two four one pick three thirty five dollars sixty two cents. Early pick four two hundred seventeen dollars fifty cents. And there they go, brisk beginning for Playboy Johnny. He bounds away from the far outside. Yogi got milks into second, mission at the spas up close from third. Then Mr. Corleone, the Glominator is second last and highest rank is the early trailer and they are single file up the back stretch. Playboy Johnny almost a length to Yogi got milk from the rail. In third is Mission at the Spa, and he gets a good running path heading into the turn. He makes his move after Playboy Johnny. Mission at the Spa with a little bit of momentum heading into the turn. Mr. Corleone's a little less than four lengths from his stablemate. Another length and a half back to highest rank, beginning his bid along the rail. The Glominator's the last of all. Playboy Johnny confronted by Mission at the Spa. Mission at the Spa with the entire stretch to move on by. Playboy Johnny tries to fight him off. To the outside is Mission at the Spa. We got a good one developing at the eighth pole. Break of about four lengths to Yogi Got Milk with highest rank. Mission at the Spa comes away with the lead. Playboy Johnny is back to second. He fought his heart out this afternoon, but it's Mission at the Spa in hand under the wire. From Playboy Johnny, highest rank, and Yogi Got Milk fourth for the Super. New York bred by Saratoga Glen Farm LLC, along with Amanda Brizze. The exact is sixty-five dollars fifty cents. A one-five double, thirty-four dollars twenty cents. Four one-five pick three, thirty-six dollars fifty cents. The dollar super, one hundred sixty dollars fifty cents. A five-seven-one trifecta, forty-two dollars twelve cents. Just about ready for the sixth. And there they go, and it's a slow start for Private Joe. Private jokes at the back. Southern Commission and Lucky Lupal go out to the lead. People's Champ is up close from third inside of Tope. Life of a Tiger races with Private Joke. World Changers at the back. So Lucky Lupal gets the lead all to himself. Lucky Lupal, two and a half to Southern Commission, who will not make pace with Lucky Lupal. And People's Champ is in no hurry. He's going to bide his time four lengths from the front. Another length and a half to Private Joke, who will have to overcome the slow start. Two and a half to Life of a Tiger. More than three and a half to Tope, who's got about two and a half on World Changer. 23 and three fifths. The pace is pretty good. Lucky Lupal with the lead. Now they're going to turn up the pressure. Southern Commission gets within three parts of a length. People's Champ gets within two. That must mean that Lucky Lupal was able to slow down that half. The half one in 48 seconds. Private Joke is a little less than four off the lead. Life of a Tiger from the rail running with him. It's a big break of nine lengths or so back to Tope. And farther back is World Changer. Lucky Lupal with the lead. He went a little quick early. Southern Commission now right alongside. People's Champ is right there three deep. About a length and a half or two from the front. Private Joke's trying to close in. Three off the lead. Life of a Tiger three and a half from the front from the rail. 
Lucky Lupel right back at Southern Commission. Private Joke tries to get involved. People's Champ's under pressure. He's not responding up the rails. Life of a Tiger. Here's Southern Commission at a huge number. Andy Hernandez in Southern Commission at 24 to 1. Have put away Lucky Lou Pal. And we got a big upset here in the six. Southern Commission at a big prize from Lucky Lou Pal. Private Joke, I believe, third in a photo with Life of. 3-2 exacto, $171. 3-2-5 trifecta, $139. The dollar super, $1,018 even. 5-3 double, $220. 1-5-3 pick three, $150.25. 7th race, scratch 1A Maroc. 1A Maroc out of the 7th part of the entry. 6 Mar. And there they go. Awkward start for Magic Roy. But he is right there firing into the lead. Also showing pace is all about that bend and read the technique. So there is plenty of pace on through the early stages. Odenay Jeanne comes away in fourth. Seven Lilies gets to the rail before the seven eights. And Marble Moon is the last of all. On the front end, read the technique from Magic Roy, who will concede the lead. All about that bends in the third spot. And he's about two lengths off the pace. More than a length to Seven Lilies. Fourth against the inside. Almost a length back to Hodene Shawne. Flanked by Marble Moon. 24 and 1 fifth. Read the technique into Elias Peltroche to the 5 8 to length and a tail. To both all about that pen outside of Magic Roy. Seven Lilies two and a half off the lead. Saving ground throughout. He inches a little closer up the inside. Hodene Shawne is a little less than four lengths off the pace. And a length and a half back to Marble Moon. 48 and two fifths, an even flow for Reed the Technique. All about that bend to his flank gets closer. Seven Lilies gets within a length, although he's in a tight spot from the rail. Had to stall with that momentum. Magic Roy from between runners. Hodene Jeanne in the clear, trying to get involved. Marble Moon is still at the back. All about that bend gets to the lead from Reed the Technique. Seven Lilies just needs somewhere to go. Hodene Jeanne to the outside. Magic Roy gives way. Marble Moon's trying to commence the bid. They've, uh, they've got to come and get all about that bend. All about that bend got first run, but here's Seven Lilies now in the clear. And Seven Lilies gets right alongside. And Marble Moon makes Makes a move for third. Up goes Seven Lilies. All about that Ben fights on. Seven Lilies, a big day for Jose Baez and John Buckley, three apiece. Seven Lilies from All About That Ben. Marble Moon, th and Lilies in the winner's circle. Four five exact to nineteen dollars sixty cents. The three four double one hundred sixty eight dollars. Five three four a big pick three six hundred sixteen dollars. One of the bigger pick threes I've seen in quite some time. Here at Finger Lakes anyway. Four five six try twelve dollars seventy five cents a dollar super ninety nine dollars even. One more race on the Wednesday card. It's clear of change. Biggest field of the day. Fields ready for the night kid. Yeah. And there they go. Slow starts for try smart, try and smarten up along with Stone Cold Kitty. Out for the lead is Showmanship along the inside with the favorite Deputy Flag. Five Night Freddy comes away in third, then Ella's Ghost in the fourth spot. Gentle Spirit has the fifth position. Stone Cold Kitty away slowly, vying for fifth along the rail. About seven lengths off the pace. It's two and a half for so to kill Ola Bay, then Honorable Union Silver Gray and try and smarten up. Is the last of all and quite a battle up front through a 22-second opening quarter. The favorite deputy flag outside of showmanship. They have more than six lengths to Ella's Ghost from third with Five Night Freddy. Three lengths to Stone Cold Kitty. Gentle Spirit follows that one. And they're going to kill Ola Bay and Honorable Union as they have three sixteenths to travel. And deputy flag puts away showmanship. And there appear to be no real threats. Deputy flag with the lead. Showmanship has shifted ground into the two path. He's still trying to fight to the wire, but Deputy Flag's just a little bit better this afternoon. That's another one for leading jockey, Jamie Rodriguez. Showmanship ran well in defeat. So too did the lone debuter, Stone Cold Kitty. Got away very slowly. 2-1 exact to $13.40. 2-1-4 trifecta, $11.60. Dollar super, $60.75. 4-2 late double, $9.90. 3-4-2 late pick three, $103.62. 5-3-4-2 late pick four, $3,473.50.
And the Wednesday Pick 5 combinations are worth a little more than $4,000. $4,006.75. So a big late Pick 4 and a pretty good Wednesday Pick 5.